Hey guys and welcome back to European Ourselves 4. Uh, playing as Castile, obviously. Uh, as you can see, big Castile. Right, um, the save issue at the end of the last game just seemed to resolve itself, so not bothered. Let's uh, continue moving our armies across with our stupidly small uh, amount of boats. Uh, my chair just decides to die. Great. Okay, Switzerland's cancelled military access, that's fine. Portugal's announced France their new rival. Really, Portugal? They're fucking tiny. No Pope, no Milan, fuck off. Savoy's cancelled direct to military access. Is that because I don't have. Do I not have you as an ally? Oh no, I still got you. I still got you. I still got you. Interesting. On the boats. Boats move so quickly. That thing's still not reached Fez by the time that I've basically transported this entire freaking army. Move you over to Tlemkin. I've still not checked how that's actually pronounced. Hmm. Interesting. On the boats. Back over. Um. Ah, they're sitting there. Much attrition you taking? Two percent. On the boats, back across. Maximum of five percent. All right, do that. Split it. How's this? Fifteen, two, and twelve. Oh, that's all right, actually. So let's uh, we'll set one there. One of you can set actually in the build. Uh, 22nd of September and the 25th. Let's uh, go there and then up to the belt. Large Revolt. 21 in Leone and 18 in Andalusia. Okay. So let us ditch one dude here. Go to Hmm. That's the biggest one. Leone. Go to Andalusia. You guys go to... Oh, Leone, which is right beside you. You guys head straight to Leone. And as soon as they're there, we'll just, uh... Tick it over. We'll just click target practice. And they'll pop up and instantly die. They're there, but I don't want to drop a 20 nationalists on 28 men. It's the best way to handle them. I can't believe how many nationalists, etc. we've got. Our overextension is getting sorted. Oh, Vern was so close to being called, that's really annoying. I wonder if we got our 60 admin points back. Probably not. Probably should have cancelled it. I was hoping that we could grab it, we could get lucky, and they wouldn't manage to siege it down, but we didn't, unfortunately. Um, excellent. Okay, in his early 20s, novelist and poet, blah blah blah, Spanish Navy. Yada yada. How are you doing? Not bad. Who's got disputes to session? Anyone interesting? Nope. France, actually. You've got negative 92 prestige. God. That's unfortunate, France. There we go. They are there. Target practice. Okay, okay. They're fighting a massive army. They're fighting a decent sized army. We won the Battle of Leonate very quickly. 24 to 26. 24 guys there. 26 guys. And a build. There we go. It's only peasants they were fighting, so. No leader against no leader. Come on, there we go. Ah, oh, we didn't lose that many. Lost a few thousand. Ah, oh, my treasure's died. You can get a level 1 artist. Yep, that's what we'll do. Just make everything a bit cheaper for us. 
Ah, massive amounts of inflation. That is literally just because we've got so many. Okay, let's shove these there. Can build workshops anywhere else. We can build one down here in Tripoli. The only reason we're building these is so that we can just shove counting houses. It's not because I want the extra goods produced or anything. Obviously the extra goods produced helps, but uh, but yeah, it's not specifically because of that. I'm going to set these guys on Overn to try and stop that. Um, colonial disaster. Yeah, let's lose the Diplo points. I want our colonies to keep going. Ah, right. I'm a military tech and I get that. Admin tech and I can start to get actual these things up. This fucking expansion idea is done. We spend that much admin te uh, admin points on just coding stuff. Well, I think admin is our national focus. Yes, that's good. What are you like five, two, and three? Perfect. You've got points in good places. Hopefully, my leader will die. Queen Maria. She's forty-four. He's twenty-two. Ho oh, ho, golden quidjibo. Whatever it is. Quijos? Quijos? Oh, right here. Perfect. That's a lot of money there. That'll be a lot of money for uh, New Granada. Yeah, New Granada's actually got a decent number of people. We could, uh, could just declare war on them. Uh, but I don't want to spend my admin. <laughs> I don't want to spend my admin points uh, taking it, uh, coding it rather, and it wouldn't be New Granada that got it, it would be whatever's made here. I'll sort that out eventually. But, uh, for now, we want to take these areas down here, and these three ones down here. We'll move down here and take all of this as well, if Portugal's not going to have it, I'll take it. Oh, the Inca got a wee bit chunked out of them there. That's basically how Portugal's going to stay stay in it. <laughs> Is by taking over lands in the Americas. Because Portugal, you've got to be mine eventually. Just like I'm slowly chewing up Aragon. Truce with France, uh, 1588. Aragon's next year. Oh, these guys in Berry. So let's go and attack them, come back. Can we stick a leader on? Yeah, we can stick a wee trust Mara guy on. Hopefully he doesn't die, because he's a good, uh, he's a good heir. Don't really want him to die. What's this? Is this Patriots? Cosmopolitan Patriots, eh? Algerian Nationalists in Lagwat. This army's on its way. It's hunting you down, nationalists. 1.5k every month. I need 5,000 men. It's fine, it's fine. I'm happy with that. We can start shoving courthouses out. I don't want to, uh, I don't want to be spending my admin points where I don't need to. Although it is only 8 now, which is good. Well, uh, we'll start doing this if we need to. Oh, that means I've got an end rule, I just turned well. Oh, shit, man, they're so big. We're getting big as well. We could probably take the Ottomans just by attacking them intelligently. Uh, but it's, it's always an issue, it's always dangerous. Tripoli's still got nationalists, etc. Christ. Because they're dif distant overseas right now. As soon as I start chunking through the Ottomans and actually get a connecting border, it'll be fine. How are you feeling? Do you not like us because of something? See, I thought they wouldn't like us because we have this, and this is... Uh, part of the HRE land, but whatever. I need to start uh, start thinking about taking over princes. 
Hmm. Saxony, Tria. The Netherlands is an elector? Huh, I had no idea. Trier is an elector. We're getting attacked by Austria right now. Portugal wants military access. Yeah, sure. Who are you at war with, Portugal? No one, they just want military access. Fair enough. Right. I was going to... Yes, it's this next one. This next Diplotech is when I start to... E free manpower. Is when I start to get ourselves another fleet. Huh, this guy's actually lost quite a few men. Right, the Mamelukis are allied with Adal. Who are... Where? Down here? They're tiny. Independence is guaranteed by Oman. Yeah, like I'm bothered. So if I can attack the Mamelukis and take over basically all of them, then I'm just sitting, like, I can see, like just protect this area from the Ottomans if I ever go to war with them. Um, I have a diplomatic candidate. Yeah, there you go. How are you doing, Castilian Western News? You have a lot of troops. I bet you've got a lot of money. Miltech 14, that's pretty good. Colonial government. 14, 12, and 11, what's mine at? 14, 14, and 12. You can build provincial improvements, of course I can. Right, 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 right. What's my next plan of attack? I mean, the truce with Burgundy should be over pretty soon. Oh, it's over now, but they're in a coalition against me, so don't want to mess with that. Venice, Friesland, and Russia. Russia are far too far away to do anything. Venice and Friesland, I'm fine fighting Venice and Friesland, to be fair. Uh, Protestant zealots, eh? Can I support any rebels? What do you have? Styrian nationalists, Persian nationalists. Ah, uh, they revolted for no reason. I'd do that. Uh, it's only a little bit of extra revolt risk. They're 3.4%, but if I give them 4 ducats a month... Which am I making? I'm making 21 ducats. I wonder if I can really fuck with them. It's Crane and Graz. That's only Loristan. At least this is two places. This is these two here. Um, yeah, let's do that and see what happens. If he gets ejected, he gets ejected. But we'll, uh, we'll keep going with this anyway and see what happens. Oh, we'll establish a presence in Canada. That's easy peasy. That's, uh, Graupara. You don't even need that guy there. Oh. I can just send him here. There we go. GB. <laughs> Christ. We need to go to war with GB eventually. Oh, they're not bad now. They've almost got the British Isles. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> he got caught. That was far too quick. So, bring this guy back from here because he's done his job. And we're just waiting right now. Waiting on a, a reason to attack someone. I have Baden, Württemberg, Milan, and Naples. Uh, Austria will protect them. Hmm. Yeah, they can't join in, obviously, because they're the Holy Roman Emperor. So what you need to do is you need to look. Who is Austria at war with? Trier, Alsace, Baden, and Ulm. Who can I go to war with? So basically right now is these guys, these guys, and these guys. <laughs> I had to go to war with the Mamelukis, but that's not for another three years. Oh, France isn't for another eight years. Oh, so my next war's got to be the Mamelukis. Hmm. I don't know if I should shove men down there yet, or not. Hmm. Three years. Three years is a long time. Let's uh, speed four for now. Graupara has become self-sustaining, as I knew it would. Which is here. 
Oh, so that's not actually... Oh, yeah, we knew it wouldn't be part of Las Guianas. Las Guianas is actually quite small. Quite small uh, colonial area that you get there. So they'll get that, but then New Granada gets the rest. Quito has become self-sustaining. Which means that we should go down here and move you there. It's not like you're sieging or anything like that. That is an awesome colony though. 24 ducats from the province. Oh, only 12 there. That was weird. Archers versus muskets. Miltech up. I'll lose army structure. Yeah, Miltech up. So I sent him there. Hmm, unfortunately Portugal's down here with stuff. Sure, Portugal, if you don't stop colonising, I'm going to have to beat you in the face. <laughs> Unfortunately for you. Because it's really beginning to bug me. This is my land. The, the land to the west is mine. As you should see by this here. The Pope says it's mine, means it's mine. You fucks. We get land attrition and 50% force limit, which would be glorious. So, even though we're only two year, three year ahead of time, and one of our neighbours has it, although it is an extra tactics bonus. Hmm. Yeah, sure, Austria. Yeah, see, Austria's got a bit of an army again. You need to sort yourself out, Austria. Christ. You've only enforced rights reform. Shit. But uh, I'm going to need to Augsburg, Bohemia, Brandenburg, Palatinate, Saxony, Trier, and the Netherlands. I'm going to need to start grabbing some of these lands up. Baden, nope, Al Augsburg is, but that means I need to fight through Bavaria and stuff. Milan. God, I've got a bit of fighting to do before I can become the Holy Roman Emperor. It used to be a lot easier because you would just give them a loan. When they defaulted on the loan, you could then take it. Uh, who are you? Oh, you're not at war with anyone. So that's basically what I'm going to need to do. What's your mission? Our claims to Northern Italy. Yeah, that's really going well for you. I can invest in extended supply trains. Ooh, I can get this. Two years ahead of time though, I don't really want to waste it. Uh, they have colonies close to ours, that's fine. Not too bothered about it, let's recall him from there. The abandon. Yes, of course we've lost the claim. Is it here? Yep, there we go. Burgundy is now the people controller. Fucking barely. Uh, we've got 35, but I'm not going to spend it. Uh, all we need is one of our guys that we've got points in to get in. Or this 8 year old to die, which would be nice. And then we'll get the Curia again, which would be extra nice. Just the stuff that you get is great. Aggressive expansion impact's nice. Uh, all we need to do is wait on one of those guys dying. The Great Statement's died and we've lost our Royal Marriage of Portugal. Let's get it again, that's fine. As soon as we get the Curia, it won't matter. Bohemia's announced them as a rival. A new military engineer. Gonna wait until this goes down a bit. Or until we max out, which we're miles away from maxing out anyway. Right, so we're going to call an episode anyway, guys, because we just about hit 20 minutes. So, as always, thanks a lot for watching. Do remember, if you enjoyed the episode, drop a like down below. And if you want to see more European Rose Alice 4, then subscribe to the channel. It means a lot to me. It means you get an update whenever a new episode comes out. Thanks a lot for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.